Hi, I'm Linda from the Ada Community Library, and usually when you see me doing a program, I am doing science. But today we are doing science and art, because today we are doing holiday mobiles. And a mobile is a piece of art that moves. And uh, you usually have uh, very lightweight elements, and they are suspended with wire or string, and then they move with air currents, or sometimes they use a motor. So we are going to be using some very lightweight elements. Um, and you can do a lot of things uh, for your mobile elements. This is uh, a little penguin that I cut out of a scrap of wrapping paper. And so that's a fun thing to use for a mobile. Uh, then I glued it onto a piece of uh, very lightweight cardstock. So it's very light, and then I attached a string to it. Okay. And then I have some other very lightweight ornaments also. Um, this is just a little foam ball with some little glittery things and a bell, and that's fun. So I am going to show you the elements that I am going to be using for my mobile, and then I will plan it, and then we'll see how it goes together. Okay, so I've gathered some supplies and I'm just going to take you on a tour of them. Here we have uh, some skewer sticks, which are really good for supports. I also have a uh, small dowel if, uh, if I decide I need something a little bit beefier, which I don't think I will. Here are a couple of shapes that I um, glued to the cardstock and cut out uh, from some scrap wrapping paper. I've got a couple of, uh, these are ornaments from the Dollar Tree. And they are self-inflating balloons, and they're a lot of fun. If you haven't tried them, I recommend them. They actually, um, you hit them, and then there's a chemical reaction inside that inflates them. Okay, and then here are some other ornaments from the Dollar Tree, little mirror balls and other ornaments from the Dollar Tree. And then I also have my hot glue gun um, plugged in. And uh, I also tied some uh, some string to each of my items so that I can tie them onto my mobile. And now I am going to come up with a plan to on how I want to build it because it's always good to have a plan first with something like this. All right, I'll be right back. Okay, so here is my planned mobile. Uh, at the bottom, I will have this little Santa balloon and then a bell and a little red mirror ball on the other end of the stick and we'll find the balance point for that. And then on the top bar here, I'm going to have uh, this first balance stick attached. And then at the end, we will have a little penguin. And then on the other side, we are going to have a couple of balls uh, attached together and another balloon. So I didn't use all my parts and that's fine. I think it's gonna be fun. Um, it won't take me too long to make. And then of course at the top, you are gonna to wanna to hang it so there will be a string at the top and we will find the valance points uh, for both of these bars. And I have uh, a little contraption here that I've built just so that I can show you how we are gonna do that. Um, this is just some um, foam core and I put a bar across and this little wire hook and we will use that to find the balance point for our mobile. You don't have to do this at home. You can just uh, put a string around it and find the balance point. Um, but I wanted to be able to show you easily on camera. So that's why we have that. All right, hang on. Okay, so here is the bottom uh, bar of our mobile. And as you see, uh, the balloons over here, the bell and little mirror ball are over here. Now, which of these items do you think, which of these sides do you think is heavier? Okay, um, I can tell you, you can guess, but you know, this is bigger and these are smaller, but this is made out of metal and this is a balloon, so you know it's it's super light, okay? So we are going to use our little hook here to try and figure out where the balance point is. Okay, so here's the middle, and at the middle, see it falls over to that side really easily. We're gonna see if we can figure out where the balance point is for this thing. Well, see, and over here, this side's heavier because it has this long bar, okay. So we want 
to be very careful. See if we. Okay, so it's right around here. It's very close to right here. You can see that they kind of just. It's such a delicate operation trying to find the balancing point. All right, so I'm going to say it's right there. Now I am going to take this off the hook while keeping my thumb right there, and I am going to mark it. I've got a pen right here. I'm just going to mark that spot. And that is where we will tie our string, and we'll see if that works. Okay, so here is that bar. I've tied the string to it, and I can slide that string ever so slightly one way or the other, uh, or the other if uh, I need to, to get the balance just right. But as you can see, it balances pretty well. Okay, now we are going to go up to the next bar. Okay, so here we have um, everything that's going to be on this mobile. As you can see, here is our uh, bottom bar that we were working on. And you can see it's all still not quite balanced. There we go. And then the top bar has that uh, lower bar attached to it. And then there's this little penguin on the end and then some mirror balls and another balloon on the side. And so now we are going to try to balance this top part, okay? So that's, it's getting more complex. Now, uh, here is our hook, and in, uh, in the interest of uh, full disclosure, uh, I don't know if you can see this, I actually took a little bit of glue and put it right here because I realized it was so hard to balance that other one because the round wire had such a tiny bit of, uh, of area that it was sitting on. So I think with a little bit of glue, it'll make that area just a little bit bigger. Uh, it's, it's all dry, of course. And now we will be balancing uh, this larger mobile. I know you can't see the bottom bar, but let's just see where it balances. Oh, that's pretty close. Okay, that looks really good. Maybe a tiny bit more. I think we found our, our balance point. Okay, so there it is. There's the, the bottom part and then the top part, and it looks really good. Now I might add one more layer at the, at the very top. Um, you can't add layers at the top. It's really, really hard to, to add layers at the bottom though because of course it's all balanced the way it is and, and now that it's balanced let's go ahead and mark where it's balanced right there and we will tie a string to it and then hang it up so here it is our holiday mobile uh, if you give it just a little push it will start spinning around that's kind of fun. I hope you've enjoyed this video and that maybe you'll build your own mobile.